There's a budget battle in Fitchburg between the city's mayor and some city nonprofit organizations. Mayor Jason Gonzalez has proposed a $20 million operating budget for 2018, and the proposed budget cuts would eliminate $125,000 in city funding to local nonprofits like the Boys and Girls Club of Dane County and Badger Prairie Needs Network. NBC 15's Alice Kang was at the public hearing tonight and has more. John and Amy, the, tonight's first public hearing brought in more than 100 people. Some had to stand outside of council chambers because the room was at capacity. Now, many people at the meeting wore T-shirts that said, Stand Up for Our Kids, and there were signs that said, Our Kids Are a Priority. This, of course, in response to the mayor's proposed budget that doesn't include funding for nonprofit organizations. The Boys and Girls Club of Dane County president and CEO Michael Johnson has been one of the most outspoken about the cuts, and he says it would have devastating consequences to the community. The impact on the cuts that they're looking to make would impact 4,500 Fitchburg residents, 800 and something kids and adults who come to the Boys and Girls Clubs, and over 2,400 uh, families who um, receive food from the food pantry and then Thanksgiving we be impacted about a thousand people we serve there. Fitchburg's Mayor Jason Gonzalez says these cuts need to be made in order to keep up with the growing city. He says the proposed operating budget isn't done and there's room for city alders to come up with their own proposals to decide how to distribute the money to local organizations. By giving roughly you know, I think there's roughly $300,000 before we hit the levy limit, and that's the state law in which we can't levy any more taxes. That gives the alders room to make some decisions on what, what they might want to add or what they might want to take out and add. Last week, some community leaders said they began the recall process of the Fitchburg mayor after the controversy over the budgets. They say if city alders don't show support for nonprofit groups, they have a plan to recall them as well. And at tonight's public hearing, people living in Fitchburg had different opinions about the mayor's proposed budget, while a majority of those at tonight's meeting were against the proposed cuts to nonprofit funding. Some residents say they're happy with the mayor's budget because they say he has a taxpayer's best interest in mind. We both support the mayor's proposed 2018 operating budget as submitted for this public hearing tonight. The budget is well thought out fiscally and socially responsible and meets the needs of the city at this time. I think we have a responsibility to help our kids uh, lead uh, successful lives and they need something to do after school, uh, strengthening their families. Michael Johnson says he has started fundraising for the Boys and Girls Club on his own. He says he has raised about $75,000 and they will do whatever it takes to help kids in the community.